And now, an excerpt from Arnold Schwarzenegger's autobiography. If I had to pick a favorite movie of mine, I'd have to say it would be the one where I played a guy who was elected governor of California but did a terrible job. <laughs> that was such a funny movie. The guy kept making things worse all the time. It was hilarious. <laughs> To the, the big show where tonight, what are we celebrating tonight, Ed? Well, uh, Ed? Ed? I said Ed. You know why? Oh, I said Ed because two reasons. One, you're not important enough to me for me to remember your name. And two, <laughs> I, was, I had Ed on my mind because that's apparently the name Santa is using right now <laughs> as he travels the country in an RV uh, on his way to San Diego. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. How about that? Sorry for calling you Ed there, but I was thinking about Santa. No, that's fine. Co code name Ed. I like that. Code name Ed? That's his Is name. Is that our movie about Santa? Yeah, sure. That's a good idea for a movie. Like, we'll have a movie called Code Name Ed, and it'll be about Ed and, uh, and uh, Mrs. Boyd, and they'll go around, and uh, they're in an RV, but they give out presents to the needy. Yeah, and the RV is pulled by eight reindeer. Reindeer, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's how you know it's really Santa. But only when he gets a flat, that's when they bring out the reindeer. You, yeah, a flat reindeer? <laughs> I've seen a few in my day. You know what, I think a flat reindeer is very similar to a uh, Rotterdam, Rotterdam Bugler, Bugler, whatever it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What was it? What was it? We, we, Rotterdam Bugler. Rotterdam Bugler? Sure. Yeah. What was the other one? The Oslo Tatler? Yeah, that's right. I think Oslo Tatler sounds like a Bond villain. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's like, sure, you're Oslo Tatler. Yes, Mr. Bond, and you will not survive this one. <laughs> Tell me, Oslo, does being an evil genius compensate for having a metal mohawk? How dare you? Soon you will suffer under a device called Codename Ed. <laughs> Rather enjoying this. <laughs> I know I'm the only one, but still, it's all right. Uh, what time is it, Ed? It's street mail time, that part on the show. The Oslo Tadler called like the shame you feel after receiving a Rotterdam bugler. Play the jingle. Euro crashes and Euro litter. Get on the dance floor and shake your Twitter. Bum, 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 bum. Check some tweets. Plus emails. Plus email. email time again. Hey, uh, before we do the emails, though, do you want to do a quick uh, public domain free Christmas song? Oh, my favorite. All right, let's sing one then. It's uh, what about Here We Come a Caroling? You ready? Oh, that's a good one. Um, and a one, and a two, and a one, two, three, four. Here we come a caroling. Let's what everybody says. Mr. and Mrs. Boyd are going to say, This is from uh, Paula in Winnipeg, Canada. You ever been up there? Beautiful. Oh, what Love a it. place. I tell you, you know what they've got there in Winnipeg? They, uh, they've got that river there. <laughs> I fell in that river. Did you really? Yeah, yeah, I did. I tell you, it's true. I fell in that river. I was shooting a film in Winnipeg, Canada, and there, there, there was a scene where I had to go in the river. Uh, at least they said it was a movie. And then I... Uh, <laughs> And I fell in the river and I cut myself and I had to go for a tetanus shot, but it was late on a Friday night. And the only place that you can get a tetanus shot in Winnipeg late on a Friday night is at the methadone clinic in downtown. <laughs> so, did you, did you help yourself while you were oh, there? Oh, yeah, or? well, you know, <laughs> one-stop shopping. <laughs> um, dear Craig and Jeff, do you think Howie Mandel will let you splatter coconut juice all over him? <laughs> I'm not even going to do that. I, I, I don't make fun of Howie's thing. He's got his thing. You yeah, know, that kind of don't touch me, I've got to be clean, don't put coconut juice on me thing. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't like to mess with that, it's his thing, you know, it's, it's kind of his trademark. It's, hey, it's his Mr. Boyd. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is from Robbie in Menlo Park, in California. It says, hello, Craig and Jeff and Secretariat. My two-year-old goes crazy whenever he sees Secretariat dance. It always makes her stop crying, so thanks. Well, I'll do it, but I have to tell you, I don't know if I would be letting my kids watch this show. 
I mean, we've tonight we've mentioned the Oslo Tatler, yeah, the Rotterdam Bugler, and uh, what else? Finger we, pistols. Finger pistols, yeah. And there's a very good chance I'll cuss before the end of the night. I got a There you are, right there. <laughs> right there. Anyway, who said at the door? Before we go to the commercial break, before we go to the commercial break, let's just take a, a couple of a couple of minutes for ourselves, shall we? What do you think? Yeah, a little little us time. A little quiet time. <laughs> you all right there, buddy? We'll be right back, everyone. We'll be right back.